I love this. I love the results. Hi beauties and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to try out a dryer that I received from Fent Go. I'm going to blow dry my hair on camera and I'm gonna tell you guys my first impressions. So if you'd like to find out more, then just keep watching. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you for joining me for today's video. And if you're new to my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications. That way you won't miss any of my uploads. So this is the finished result after I have straightened my hair. I have naturally curly hair. However, currently I have a keratin treatment in my hair. I will link information down below about the keratin treatment that I have in my hair, as well as information about this dryer and other products that I'm going to use in today's video. This is what my hair looks like after I have blow dried my hair as well as straightened it. I'm not going to straighten my hair on camera because I have done that plenty of times in other videos. I'm going to dry my hair. I'm going to show you guys the various features on this dryer as well as come back and give you guys my first impressions when I'm done straightening my hair. So without further delay, let's go ahead and dive into today's video. I'm going to be testing out this hair dryer and it is called Fit go and it is a high speed dryer this model is td-2206 okay so there's information here on the back that you can't quite see because the box is white let's go ahead and open this up so it has this little sleeve here on the box this one is white that's the top of the box so it has some cushion there to protect the dryer and this is what my dryer looks like that I've received. It has instructions here that we'll take a look at in a moment. There's information in here about how to clean and maintain the dryer. So this is what the dryer looks like out of the box. It has Velcro here to keep the cord wrapped. This is the magnetic attachment. And then this is the diffuser. The plug is a two prong plug. Reset and test button there. It's wrapped in paper here. Wow. There we go. With its constant temperature drying system, high-speed brushless motor and negative ionic hair care technology has been carefully designed by Fentgo's aerodynamic laboratories to meet your personal drying needs. High-speed brushless motor, so it tells you about the speed of the motor, 110,000 RPM high-speed brushless motor. So what it says there negative ionic hair care technology yada 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 vertical motor positioning noise reduction design and it has an on off switch a low speed high speed and a temperature button so you can have hot warm or cold air so let's go ahead and get started before my hair air dries <laughs> Woo! Wow, I wasn't ready for it. I wasn't ready. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I have paper on this too. The handle is also wrapped in paper. So I like that. Your product is well protected when it is shipped to you. Oh, okay. Look, guys. I'm about to blow away in this room. <laughs> I, I don't know if I'll be able to show you this because of the lighting. Okay. That's yellow. That's red. And that's blue. My lights back on and let's go. Let's try to dry the hair here. Interesting. I'm going to go with the highest setting. So we're red now.
for the sake of the demonstration I'm gonna remove the attachment and dry my hair for a little bit without it just so we can see what it does Still on hot This is a powerful dryer. <laughs> okay, so the attachment is very helpful. Okay. I just moved it down to the medium setting. dryer is still on the hottest setting but it is a little less powerful blowing at a lower speed I meant to use a little bit of heat protectant and I forgot. And this is usually something I add when my hair is wet. This is Oribe Royal Blowout Spray. So I'm just gonna put a little bit in my hand and apply it to my hair. Now that it's almost dry, because I want it in my hair prior to me straightening it. So here we go. And my hair is about, it feels like it's about maybe 80% dry. And I haven't been drying my hair very long. Maybe 10 minutes at the most. This is pretty fast. Okay, hair is now dry. And of course, I need to straighten my hair. I have a little bit of static, just a little, but not too much. And I will still, again, have to straighten my hair. I haven't straightened it in a while, and I probably need a trim. <laughs> I haven't straightened it in about, I don't know, a month maybe. I've been lazy, and so it probably needs to be trimmed. But this is what my hair looks like after drying. So what I'm gonna do, because I have straightened my hair many times on camera in my keratin videos, feel free to check out my keratin treatment videos, but I've straightened my hair many times on camera, so I'm not gonna straighten it today because it's all about this Fit Go dryer. I'm gonna straighten my hair off camera and then I'll be back to tell you guys my first impressions of this Fit Go dryer. I am back and I've straightened my hair and I like. And just so you guys know, again, you saw me apply the Oribe Royal Blowout Heat Styling Spray, kind of mid drying my hair. I also have on Design Essentials Diamond Oil Sheen Spray. I have a little bit of this on. I used my Gisu Honey Infused Hair Oil that I always use. 
And then I also used a little bit of Oribe Super Fine Hairspray. And I only used a little bit of each of those products. And this is what my hair looks like. My experience with the dryer, I really liked how fast the dryer worked. It is very powerful for sure. I like the ease of being able to change between three heat settings, like hot and then warm and cool. I also like that it has more than one speed. I enjoyed that as well. So if the highest speed that I was using for most of the video is too much, then you can use the lower speed. And of course, I didn't use the diffuser, but if you were going to use the diffuser, you would usually use that with a lower speed. So that's perfect. I like the magnetic attachment. I think that, that is so easy. <laughs> Like that is a super easy way to apply the attachment. It seems like it's a nice sturdy piece of equipment. Like it does seem like it's a really good quality blow dryer. While my hair is straight right now and it does definitely need to be trimmed for some reason, like the left side of my hair seems to grow faster than the right. <laughs> so it looks a little bit slightly uneven, but, um, I feel like my hair has a lot of movement in it and I like that. I even like how my straightener applied to the hair. Sometimes when you're straightening your hair, it's not as smooth when it is going over the hair, but I felt like the passes when I was straightening my hair were smoother than they sometimes are with another dryer. So I felt like my hair was already smoother after blow drying and therefore it was easier for me to straighten my hair, if that makes sense. So right now I feel like my hair is pretty shiny and healthy looking and I had a very good experience with this dryer. Definitely recommend it. I do have another blow dryer, but this is definitely going to bump that blow dryer and this is going to be the one that I'm going to reach for whenever I need to dry my hair. This is especially going to come in handy when I do not have a lot of time. I can definitely see me using this on a regular basis. Oh, I love it. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. It is so pretty. I definitely think that my hair looks better than sometimes it does with other dryers at this point. I think about the fact that I put my keratin treatment in two months ago and my hair looks this good today. I definitely think that this dryer helped with the overall appearance of my hair. I'll also link um, the straightener. I used a T3 Single Pass X straightener but they no longer sell that one but they do sell others so I will link the straightener that is the closest to the one that I use today. I'll link that down below too in case you're interested in that. It's pretty pricey, but it works amazing. So that concludes my first impression sort of tryout of this dryer. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and I will respond. And if you've not already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button before you leave. So I'll be seeing you guys again very soon in my next video. So until the next time we meet again, this is Savvy, signing out.